guys Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Welcome back to my channel Here we are going to talk about Either Neither And both What do these very similar Sounding words mean And what are they used for Let's have a look at The definition between Either Neither And both all of the words here are used when you are talking about two different things. Either I have two choices, I can only pick one. Neither. I have two choices, I can pick zero or none of them. It means not either. Both. I have two choices, I can pick two of them. Which cookie do you want? Either I don't mind, neither I'm on diet. Of course, I pick both. Let's try another example. Do you want to visit Swiss or Australia? I like both countries. Can we visit both? Both in this sentence means that you like the two options that were given and you would like to do both activities instead of choosing just one. Do you prefer chicken or fish? Neither. I'm a vegetarian. We use neither to disagree with both options given to us. Do you want to cook? Or sprite. Either one is good. I'll have what you're having. We use either to say that we don't really have a preference since both options are okay. Either or, neither nor, and both and. Let's talk about either or and neither or. To help you understand more, imagine you are choosing which cake to buy and you are considering two options. I can buy either the strawberry cake or the chocolate cake. What? Sort out? Oh my god, now I can buy neither the strawberry cake nor the chocolate cake. When you are presenting the choice of two different things, you can use both words either or with each item after the two words. You can also use neither nor to emphasize that you don't want to choose either of them. I'll either leave later today or arrive earlier tomorrow. I like neither math nor physics. Neither has a negative value, so it is not necessary to put the negative verb with neither nor because it can be a double negative. I don't like neither math nor physics, it's wrong. You definitely don't want to use that. Both and. Both followed by and are used as correlating coordinators. Both Liz and Steve help me with my report. She ate both the rice and the meat, either plus singular noun, neither plus singular noun. An important point to note about either and neither is that they are used with singular nouns. Do you want it ready for Thursday or Friday? Either day is fine for me. That tennis game was very close. Neither player had a clear advantage. Both plus plural noun. We can use both with plural nouns. Can we have our next lesson on 13 or 14? If the student wanted to book a lesson on the 13th and the 14th, he or she could say, could we have a lesson on both 
days both plus plural noun either of neither of both of plus pronoun I'm waiting for Steve and Liz has either of them called? no, neither of them has called yes, both of them have called and they are going to be 10 minutes late why am I using has? why am I using a singular verb? there are two people Steve and Liz either of and neither of take a singular verb so even though I'm speaking about two people using has is correct with either neither we often use the determiners like my you your his her the its our their this those a few minutes ago, I say that either and neither are used with a singular nouns, right? But if you are describing plural nouns, you can add the word of before them. Can you tell me which one you think is better? Woo! This look great! You can buy either of these dresses. This one looks good. And that one looks good. Both of these dresses look good on you. Either of and both of plus determiner plus plural noun. Neither of these dresses looks good. Let's try the others. Neither of plus determiner plus plural noun. Either plus side. When we use either with the word side, it means both sides. You can park on either side of the street. This means both sides of the street. Both. Both sides. There were stones on either side of the door. You can see here that either side does mean both sides. Please do remember that we don't use both in a negative sentences. Instead, we can use either and neither to agree with a negative statement. I'm not going to class today. Yeah, I'm not going either. We must use a negative word. I'm not in this case. Yeah, me neither. You can use me neither. Do you want to go to Kimi's party? I don't want to go. Neither do I. Neither plus same auxiliary do plus subject. Or you can say I don't either. These two replies have the same meaning. Both are fine. But neither do I is a little bit more formal. I didn't sleep well last night. Neither did I. Neither plus same auxiliary verb did plus subject. I did not either. Okay, last one. We can say either, neither, and both alone without anything to make it simpler. Do you want milk or chocolate? Either. Do you want milk or chocolate? Neither. Do you want milk or chocolate? Both. Phew, there's a lot of information. If you need to remember which way around these two words belong, there is a simple trick to help you. Neither is negative. You can remember this because neither and negative both start with N. Remember, neither is often used when both options are unacceptable. Either tends to be used 
in a positive way when one option will be chosen. Finally, we come to the end of this video. You've done such a fantastic job. If you want to watch my other English videos, you can click on the playlist in the description box or you can click right here. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also follow all of my social media. Thank you so much for watching and see you. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.